Welcome back. <gasps> All right, I heard you might be joining the student council. Kirijo Senpai, you sure you want to let a slacker like this guy join? I'm not forcing him, but if you're concerned about his work ethic, would you rather join yourself? Oh, uh, I'll pass, but thanks for the offer. Student council, huh? Well, as exciting as that sounds, I think I'll pass. That reminds me. So, I heard Mitsuru ask you to join student council. Sorry if it feels like you're being forced to, but I'm sure she could really use your help. Well, anyway, it's ultimately up to you, so give it some thought. But I'm already in it. As president of the student council, I'm really quite busy. In fact, it's quite rare that I have any time to rest. Greatly appreciated. I won't require your help constantly, but stop by the student council room whenever you have time. I look forward to your contributions. Sure. Hmm. I don't think I really have time for student council. I'm busy enough with archery, studying, and fighting shadows. It's already kind of a lot. And I mean, Kurito Senpai is just... Uh, actually, it's it's nothing. Uh, never mind. Mm. It's on TV tonight. Today's exchange rate. Oh God, economy! The shifting economy has strengthened the dollar against the yen. The current exchange rate is one USD to 115 yen. The change marks the yen's 1.4% weakening from yesterday. Damn. Who's messaging me? Hmm? Wait, I'm getting messages from the fucking game area? Come play a popular game and try to win a prize. Then stick around and hop into one of our many immersive video games. There's great fun to be had whether you're alone or with friends. It's a promo message. Is that it? We can't wait to see you. Oh, part-time position open. We hope everyone is having a great day. Shigal is looking for someone to work at the cafe today. Students may apply, no experience required. This is a paid position and perks include free pheromone coffee. We look forward to meeting. Oh, a free pheromone coffee! Fuck, let's go! Uh, yeah. Work part time, let's go! Ooh, I like this. I sweated it out while working part time as a waiter. Customer called me over and praised my service. I dealt with housewives complaining that the pheromone coffee has no effect. <laughs> uh, sorry, ladies. Um, it's actually gonna take a few sips of this coffee. You see, basically, you only had yourself one cup, so therefore you only increase your charm by one point. Wait, 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 why are you leaving? Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am! Here's your paycheck for today. Try to use it wisely. Thank you. After dealing with difficult customers, I feel like my charm and courage have increased. Yeah. Works for me. It's getting late. I should head back to the dorm. Have you gotten acclimated to our school yet? Mm, sure have. I think. That's... I see. Your ability to adapt to a new environment is impressive. Uh, by the way, if you need me for anything, uh, most times you can find me in the lounge. Uh, however, I won't be present if there's business I must attend to. If I'm not at the dorm at night, then you'll have to put off any exploration for another day. I hope you understand. No, I get it. It's fine. Okay. Let's see. Track practice. Hey. You're free, right? Let's hang out. Hagakure ramen. That's good for your skin. We'll let you in on a secret. Our ramen is really good for your skin. Uh, it's always that shit. Our tender pork is a friend of beautiful skin. Make yourself shine by eating at Hagakure. 
You're coming today, right? You better. Jesus Christ. All right, who can I, uh, who can, okay, I, I bond with you, so I should be able to get you up to rank. <laughs> huh, you coming with? How about we go out for ramen again? I wanna hear more about you too. If it's not gonna be anything good, then I'll just reload. Man, this always hits the spot. This flavor's pretty addictive, huh? Mm-hmm. I'd say so. Despite its simple appearance, the soup has a complex flavor that's enhanced by the noodles. By the way, dude, why the hell is your dorm co-ed? No reason. Can you like just waltz on in to Takeba-san's room and stuff? I'm not a pervert, Kenji. Get your head out of the gutter. Of course. No way. Oh. <laughs> I gotta remember, um, whenever dealing with these guys, I actually have to kind of like, all right, I gotta, I gotta play into them. All right, so let's see. Uh, it's a choice between no way and that's a secret. Because if I just outright admit it, it's kind of like, oh, shoot, yeah. But I imagine if I say that's a secret, that'll help play into his per, his, uh, you know. Please be right. That's a secret. Secret? Yeah, sure. The only secret is that nothing is going on between you two. Well, hey, it did something. Well, I'm not interested in girls her age anyway. I'm more into older women. How about you? I'm into older women too. I prefer girls my age. I like them all. I think if I rel if I agree with him, it'll probably give him more bonus points. Maybe. Uh, I, th I, th I think. It's... I just agree with him. Go with the safe option. No way, really? Not a lot of guys out there who feel the same way. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> okay. For the most part, you just kind of have to agree for the most part. Man, you're cooler than I thought. To tell you the truth, if this stays between us, I have my eye on someone. Oh, yeah? This is the secret plan I was talking about. Basically, I'm just going to ask this girl out. Oh, yeah? But get this. She's a teacher at our school. Buddy, this ain't Persona 5. Not like that's gonna stop me from making my move. But you gotta promise you won't tell anyone, okay? Why? Because you kind of realize this, if you try to pursue a teacher like that, it's, it's gonna really reflect negatively on them. It might look weird if a teacher and a student are having a thing, you know? It might look weird. Kenji, my dude, it's illegal. Domitika told me his secret plan. I feel like our relationship is stronger. <laughs> oh god. I forgot how fucking weird this dude is. Oh crap. My favorite show's about to start. See ya. And you just bailed. Well you didn't you didn't put me the bill, did you? Eh, whatever. I parted away with the Tomachika and went back to the dorm. All right. Welcome back. Uh, by the way, the internet line, which was ripped apart by the shadow earlier this month, will be fixed tomorrow. <clears throat> if you have a computer in your room, you should be able to connect. So that takes care of everything that was damaged. No. Except, of course, Nakihiko's rib cage. Yeah, that's going to take a little bit more than just a couple of days. If you wanna go ahead, oh. free to do uh, speaking of the internet. You play any online games, dude? Online games? Yeah, definitely. Nice! I just, I got just the thing then. Here, you gotta check this one out. It's called Innocent Sin Online. Uh, sorry Junpei, I already kinda completed Innocent Sin. No, 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 dude, this is the online version. Okay. I used to be totally addicted to it, but I got, I got kinda burnt out. Maybe you'll get a kick out of it. Thanks. Oh, there you are, Ikutsuki. Hello. How are your explorations of Tartarus proceeding? Really good. Fantastic. Excellent. And then continue the good work. That's all you have to say about that. Hmm? Hmm. 
online games. Well, some casual recreation is fine, but try not to get carried away. If it should evolve into an unhealthy obsession, need I say the rest? Please don't execute me, ma'am. Oh? Tons of people are playing the same game together. And it's online, right? I imagine that makes it even harder to know who you're playing. I guess not knowing your enemies makes it easier, in some respects. I think. As for me, I prefer to look my opponent straight in the face before we compete. We know. Many of you are eagerly anticipating tomorrow. Due to the Golden Week holiday, the highways are expected to be jammed bumper to bumper. Traffic conditions are expected to worsen from tomorrow until May 3rd. Officials expect the roads to be cleared by May 4th. From all of us at Action News, have a happy Golden Week. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, I'm so glad we can start using the internet again. I've been meaning to check out the new summer clothes that are coming out now. I guess I could just look at magazines, but it's quicker to just check online. Plus, it's free. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I hear lots of gamers love Innocent Sin Online. Well, since tomorrow's a holiday, you should play it, dude. Yeah, that's probably what's gonna happen. Anyway. To the mall. Da -da -da. Okay. Let's see what's going on over here at the game. At the uh, game parade again. House of the Deceased to raise my courage again. Uh... Sure. Honestly, getting my social stats up will be beneficial. Can't go wrong with that. But I mean, technically you could, but... <laughs> Today is show -a day There's no school. Come to think of it, I should be able to connect to the internet now. I could try playing the game Junpei gave me. Alright, let's do that. Studying at your desk takes some time, but academics will increase. On days when you don't have school, you may choose to take advantage of your afternoon by studying. You can now use the computer in your room to play Innocent Sin Online. Playing the game will take up time, but you might meet new people. All right, until nighttime, let's do it. I think I'll spend the day playing online. Autumn, the year 1990X. I have one new message from Phil. Reality is just a series of events and players acting out what they believe to be true. When we accept that fate, our world becomes as real as any other. Reality is but a reflection of our own thoughts and expectations. But what if we were merely reflections in someone else's mirror? Are you prepared to look through that mirror to discover the truth? Ooh. I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. I don't see any other players. A girl in red approaches me. Sup? Is it? Oh wait, are you a noob? You are, huh? Oh wow, you haven't even finished making your character yet. <laughs> Guess the new default skin thing was for real. I got this cool outfit in the patch too. Not like it brought in many pe new people. This is kind of a dead MMO these days. Eh, welcome to the game. Cool to see you around. It's not popular anymore? Sorry, I, I got kind of out of character there. We are supposed to be our alternate selves, right? Uh, yeah. So, we're gonna call your character. All I see is no data. Hmm. Hey, I got a good name for you. How about Tatsuya? Yeah, that's perfect in my opinion. I'll change mine to Maya, okay? Sure. Have a little deja vu. Me? Yes, I did. <laughs> That's clever. Oh, really? I'm impressed. I didn't think many people played that. I literally finished playing it. Well, if you see any jokers, be sure to rescue me, okay? <laughs> 
Anyway, I'm usually idling here on my days off. So if you're bored, maybe we can level together. It sucks to be lonely. I've become acquainted with a player who goes by the name Maya. We're making a shit ton of bonds today. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the Hermit Arcana. And thus the Hermit Arcana was established. Sorry, gotta go. Remember, let's think positive. Tasto! Maya's player signed off. I decided to log out as well. Now that I played freaking Persona 2 Innocent Sin, I all of the references just hit me all at once. Yo, Yo what's up? Oh yeah, you can use that computer over there whenever you want, by the way. You can put whatever software you want onto it, too. Oh, but don't play online games on it. It'd suck if someone else accidentally used your account. Use, you, can, you, you can use the shared computer in the first floor lounge for research or to run purchase software. All software is single use only and can be purchased from Mangastar Net Cafe. Like many activities, using the computer will take a portion of your day. Okay. I wonder if somebody's already created a go-to guide for maxing out every social link. And if there is, I kind of want to see if I can look it up and try it out myself. Yeah, no one's back yet. And we have school tomorrow. I guess that means Tartarus is a no-go. Yep. Nice. Alrighty then. Time to hit the hay. Back to Paulonia Mall I go. Looks like this is going to be the majority of my evenings being spent for the most part. Hmm? Oh, Akihiko. Let's go. Oh. Did you need something from the police station, too? I just finished saying hi to Kurosawa-san. Took a look at some weapons while I was there. I know you're in charge of our equipment, but it doesn't hurt to check out what's in stock every now and then. You know. Huh. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing a new haul of equipment. Well, I mean, of course you are. Once you get back into the game, you're gonna be, uh, beast. What do we got? You're the answer. Compete in a competitive quiz game. Raises academics. Sure. Hello. I played the quiz game, You're the Answer. I learned from my wrong answers and gained new knowledge. Hell yeah. Honestly, any increase to my social stats is just a benefit in my personal opinion. But yeah, I'm legitimately curious if somebody's actually made a guide. Then again, the game hasn't been out that long, so... Maybe it's not enough time to actually create a fully fleshed out guide yet. Hey, I spent my entire day off at the Net Cafe. You can play computer games there, so I end up trying a bunch of different ones. Seriously? <sighs> I knew that they sell computer software but there, but I didn't realize you could use them in the private booths too. It's always so packed there though, so I never felt like going. Yeah, it was super crowded yesterday, too. It was like a miracle I managed to get my own booth. Next time I'll just buy the game. It's probably more relaxing to play it at home anyways. First bell is wrong. All right, all right. Hey, yo, Mr. Itogawa. All right. Ah, I made a gawa, and I'll be teaching. Let's call it integrative learning. <laughs> My goal is to ease some of the stress you suffer as students, of which I assume there's plenty. Think of it as psychotherapy through magic. Yes, that's right. Quiet down, no talking. Silence, I say. Were you surprised to hear me bring magic up? Well, this study was very recently published, so it's not well known just yet. But those who believe will be saved, in other words. The placebo effect is hard at work. That means believe your studies are paying off, and eventually they will. <laughs> Alright then, let's get on with our first lecture, the basics of magic. Who can use magic and who cannot? That seems like a reasonable enough starting point. 
Some of you may think magic lets you do absolutely anything. Pulling pranks, granting vengeance on your enemies. Well, if those are your first wishes that run through your mind when it comes to magic, then I'll tell you now. You'll never master the craft. This is true of both Eastern and Western sorcery. Those with wicked hearts will be either powerless or driven to ruin. There's one more vital facet to learning magic, and that is the master. Practitioners should always aspire to become as knowledgeable as their predecessors, especially if they intend to study high-level magic. But without a master's careful instruction, learning the crap becomes wholly impossible. Once you've begun your training, you'll have to live in two worlds at once, the real world and the dark realm. If you ever lose the ability to distinguish between the two, then you'll be head straight for disaster. That's what makes the guidance of a master absolutely vital. With all that out of the way, I'll move on to meditation, one of the standards in magical training. Now I've got some handouts here for you. I'm feeling sleepy. Should I close my eyes for a few minutes? No, stay the fuck awake! Well then. Well, looks like that's our time. If you think you might be interested in the practice, try meditating on the course of your day while lying in bed tonight. In vivid detail, recall such each event taking place in reverse, sort of like traveling back through time in your mind. If you have reached the point where you can do it flawlessly, you just may just have what it takes to become a good magician. <laughs> All right, that's it for today. I forced myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. Knowledge. My academics. Increase. Thanks, Mr. Itogawa. All right. We got runners. I'm so bored. Um, I'm gonna see if I can go spend time with the student council right now. <gasps> there she is. I heard you were invited to the student council. Kirito Senpai said so. Oh, I'm so jealous. I wish you could get invited. Maybe you could talk to her or something. Hello. Hey there. Oh, ah, uh, Tumi-san. Um, what do you want? I just wanted to talk. I don't have anything to talk about! Oh. Um. I, I, I'm sorry. Oh, pardon me. S sorry about that. I don't think she's willing to talk to me anymore. I should try again another time. Yeah, that's right. You, you should, you're not supposed to be too forward with her. Like, you're supposed to, like, just kind of be very patient with her. Okay, that's fine. I missed my opportunity, but I'll be able to talk to her next time. Yeah. Oh, you came back. Welcome, uh... It's Sobata, or Atomy. What was your name again? It's Sobata Atomy. Oh, no need to tell me. I was just joking. I'm not that senile. <laughs> My wife and I were just talking about you. Wait, really? Tell me. Do you like this kind of treat? Uh, what is it? Let me see. Someone gave it to me, but I have more than enough. Go ahead and take it. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Ah, oh, don't worry about it. You don't have to thank me for something as small as this. It's still a, it's still, you're still being incredibly generous, good sir. Just thank you. You're so polite, I say. You're like his complete opposite. Uh, would you like another to give to a friend? We have so many. My wife and I would take forever to finish them all. Oh, I'd like that. Thank you. Right then. Here you go. Uh, 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 for real this time. Uh, what was your name again? <laughs> Goodness, dear. It's him. Remember? My apologies. He's been terribly forgetful lately. No, believe me, I get it, Mi uh, Mitsuko-san. I get it. Here you are. Thank you. Oh, two melon breads, thank you. Say, uh, where did that boy run off to, dear? Uh, what boy? He should be here helping customers. Sorry about that. Oh, hey, there's no need to apologize. It's okay. I'm sure you could use another youngster like yourself around. 
instead of talking to an old man like me. I legitimately have no problem sitting here just listening to you talk and share stories. I have no problem with that. I'm sure our son will be back soon enough. Right, dear? Oh, my dear, he's... He's what? Oh, that's right. Our son has already passed away. Uh, oh. I'm sorry, young man. I apologize on behalf of my son for not being here to greet you. Hey, you, you don't have to apologize for that. It's okay. The elderly couple opened up about their painful past. I feel like we're getting closer! I mean, tad on, but yeah. I mean, sure, we are. We're getting closer, but, you know, just... Hey now, the two of you look like you just seen a ghost. It's dark outside. We don't need it to be dark in here, too. I, uh... <laughs> Come visit us again, will you? We'll be waiting. I'd be honored. Well, I'll see you guys later. I parted ways with the elderly couple and went back to the dorm. Oh. Hey. Uh, hey there. I'm sure you're tired of hearing this, but make sure you're fully prepared before going to Tartarus. You never know what'll happen there. There are some aspects to battle that we simply can't manage with an unprepared leader. That's true. I'm sure you don't want to put everyone else in danger, so keep that in mind. I will. The higher we advance up Tartarus, the stronger our enemies will become. Do you feel that your current equipment is adequate? I think so. I see. That's good to hear. Just don't get careless. You should consider paying Officer Kurosawa a visit when you have the time. By the way. By the way, when we were fighting in Tartarus, I was thinking, even shadows have stuff they're not good at. Like, they have weaknesses too. Like, how I'm not good at studying, you know? <laughs> For a sec, I thought they were kind of relatable. I, I guess? By the way, I can't believe it's already past the last day of April. Well, actually, over here, it's uh, only the 10th of April. I'm recording this at. It was probably one of the hardest months of my life, honestly. I hope I can relax a little next month. Let's hope so. Cherry blossoms blooming near Aomori Castle. We here at Action News recommend getting some fresh air and exercise during Golden Week. Uh-huh. Oh, God. I'd have to go all the way back over to, uh... Tartarus to do that. Let's, let's raise our charm here. It'll probably give us more charm. Oh, my freaking lord. Are you... Look at that. This only brings me one question. This only brings up one question. Is it pronounced Giffany or Jiffany? I practice some lines and mannerisms that I can use to make a good impression with girls. There we go. Morning. Morning. It's been pretty warm lately, hasn't it? Well, it is already May. Isn't it crazy how fast time flies? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Seriously! And a lot's happened. And I'm sure there's a lot more to come, too. Apathy Syndrome might not go away anytime soon, either. Since we're the only ones who can buy shadows, maybe we should be working harder. Besides, I need to get stronger too. I can't have someone else protecting me all the time. Hey, did you hear? Sonata-san's getting checked up at the hospital today. Oh, he is? He called me earlier and asked me to bring him something. Oh. 
Yep. He knows who to count on. <laughs> he only asked you because you don't have anything better to do after school. Come on, Yukari. Let him have this. Hey, I resent that. <laughs> Just kidding. So, what do you want you to bring? The class roster for 2E. Oh, yeah? Class roster? What's he want that for? Well, I don't have practice today, so I guess I'll come along and find out. You're coming too, right? Of course. Sure. Cool. Wait, wait a minute. What? Is there a problem? I mean, he asked me, and I... Uh... Well, it was me, he asked. <gasps> um, is Sonata son? Huh? In this room, by any chance? What are all of you doing here? You told us to come by. We came to see you. But you look like you're doing just fine. That's because I'm just here for a checkup. We done here, Aki? Ooh. Yeah, uh, thanks. I don't have time for this shit. Ooh. You're... Hey. Never mind. My best boy. Who was that? A friend from school. Sort of. You know how the number of apathy syndrome cases has been increasing? Well, he knows a few people who are suffering from it. So, I thought we'd have a little chat. Hey, Junpei, did you bring what I asked? Of course I did. Thanks. Hmm. All right, let's get going. Uh, should you be moving your arm around so much? <laughs> I'm fine. I've wasted enough time already. I need to get back to my training. Way, senpai why boxing you'd be surprised how awesome boxing can actually be granted I've never actually done it I'm just saying that I have a respect for people that do box you mean why did I choose the sport well it's not the sport itself I like I just wanted to learn how to fight with my bare hands <laughs> I know what it's like to feel powerless I don't ever want to feel that way again. Besides, I'm curious to see how strong I can get. It's like a game, only I'm competing against myself. Not a bad way of looking at it. That's one way of looking at it. But hey, I got you. I'm into games too. Junpei. <laughs> yeah, video games. Oh, but like fighting games. Ah. Whatever. Not into the whole JRPG, huh? I get it. I prefer JRPGs, though. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Oh, regarding Akihiko's recovery, it seems he'll still need some more time. Well, there's no need to rush things. You've all been working hard. Use the long weekend to rest. That said, there's been an uptick in the number of incidents lately, so don't be careless. I... I can't seem to shake this bad feeling I have. Perhaps it is just unnecessary concern on my part. Hey! Sanasan's gotta be, like, a superhuman or something. Didn't a shadow injure him? 
But he's acting totally normal, like it was no big deal. Normally, people wouldn't be all like, I gotta heal up fast so I can jump back into the fight. Hmm. He really is a boxing champ. Worlds apart from us ordinary folks, huh? Yeah. Akihiko was still having some tests done. He should be back tomorrow, though. Hey. Who was that guy in Sonata Senpai's hospital room? Think it was a friend of his? Yeah, it seemed like it. They didn't seem like friends. You shouldn't pry. I'm not gonna reveal it until the game does. Yeah. That's kind of what I've been doing. Like, un until the character is actually named, I'm not gonna reveal who their VA is. Like, as soon as the actual introduction is done, then I'm going to credit the VAs. So that way, again, I'm playing this with the knowledge that I played the original Persona 3. However, there might be some people that are blind to Persona 3. So, I'm just saying. I guess he did say he was a friend from school. But I don't think I've seen him at school before, so I don't know. The house of the deceased again, huh? Eh, sure, why not? Should raise up my uh, courage a bit. Hell yeah! Level two courage, ordinary. Lucky me. Golden Week starts tomorrow. Do you have any plans? Eh, not really. But I'm not gonna miss tomorrow's show. Oh, totally. Oh yeah, you're talking about Tanaka's Amazing Commodities, right? When I hear that jingle, I can't resist buying something. I never miss it when it's on Sunday afternoons. I'm about to go broke. A shopping program that airs on Sunday afternoons. Since tomorrow's Sunday, maybe I'll turn on the TV in my room and watch it. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Who is this? I have this number saved on my phone, but I can't seem to recall who you are. I bet I'll remember right away once I see your face, so drop by the store. Oh my god, Bukichi. What the hell is that emote with the freaking mustache, Yuko? What the hell? <laughs> Alright, let me try this again. Okay, let's try this a little bit again. Wait. I gotta make sure I do this right. Uh, um, uh, to me, son? Um, uh, about what happened the other day. I, um, I sort of overreacted and I, um, just wanted to say I'm sorry. I, I get really nervous when I talk to people, although I know I should really do something about it. it it's especially bad when I talk to boys. All I can think about is running away in that situation. Half the school are guys. Half the world are guys. I'm a guy! I'm a guy. Oh. I'm a guy. Uh, I know! That's why I'm so nervous now. S -s Sorry. I, I know I can't perform my duties on the student council if I'm like this. I, I have to try harder to overcome this phobia. I understand why you're scared of. I understand. Thank I understand. You very much. Thank you. I'll try to do my best. I don't think she's willing to talk to me more. I should try again another time. It's fine. It's fine. You gotta talk to her a few times, and then eventually she'll get it. But now the Bunkichi's guy like me, he got my number. I'm sorry. I I I just have to. Although, what did people do today? Spend time with Yuko, as I thought it was. The first thing I do when I get to school is look for him. Just seeing him makes me smile. Oh, what should I do? How should I express my feelings for him? Um, well, first off, just have an actual conversation with them. You don't have to rush into things. Just take your time. Start a conversation, see where it goes from there. See that girl over there? I think she's following me around. 
Uh, how should I deal with this? Talk? You can always talk, I'm just saying. There's a science teacher who brews his coffee in the test tubes. What are these? Seems kind of nasty. I kind of remember. Uh. Oh, right. Student council is. Not over here because that is the faculty office. The nurse's office. And this is the library. Okay. So I should probably make my way upward. Oh, that's the other grades. I can't go that way. Duh. Student council. It's the classroom. No one is here today. All ah, right, right, right. All right. Um, Yuko, let's spend time together. Oh. Oh, Atomikun. I've actually got to head out now to do some shopping for the track team, like buying some athletic tape and stuff. There's a lot, so it'd be nice if I had an extra hand or two to carry everything. <laughs> hint, hint. I get it. I get it. Sure, I don't mind helping. Oh, cool. Thanks. I can't rely on the other team members at all. You get it, right, Atomikun? Okay then, off to Palonia Mall we go! Sure thing. Okay, shopping for club stuff is done. Hell yeah. Also, God, I'm already loving her. I, I'm loving her line deliveries already. It's pretty good. Good thing you came with me. I didn't realize there was so much to buy. Well, sometimes it just happens, you know? Also, I wasn't really in the mental state to do this alone today. Oh? What happened? Oh, nothing major. I was exaggerating a bit. Hmm. It's still bothering me, though. On today's classic literature pop quiz, I didn't know any of the answers. Ah. And before I knew it, I dozed off. I ended up handing in a blank paper. Oof. That's bad. I mean, it wasn't your fault. You got a lot of responsibility. You've been doing a lot of stuff. I mean, hell, you're taking care of a track team. It's no wonder that, you know, you would slip up a little bit. If you take on too many responsibilities, sometimes that's just bound to happen. So I'd say, personally, it wasn't your fault. You know, right? I didn't do it on purpose. But then Mr. Okoda got all pissed off. Uh-huh. He called me to the faculty office and told me I had to write a reflection essay. A reflection essay? I had to listen to Mr. Okoda lecture me for the longest time. I can imagine that was a personal hell of itself. He was all like, uh, this rate you'll end up as a good for nothing adult, and you're not putting enough thought into your future. Ugh. Come on, it's way too early to worry about the future, isn't it? We're still just teenagers. Yeah. Well, where do I even begin with how horrible the school system is? They don't really teach, they don't really prepare you for anything in the real world. I had to look up, oh my God. You think a school will teach you how to balance your checkbook or some shit like that? Hell no. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I agree with you. That's true. Honestly, I haven't really thought about my future at all. It's kind of hard to think about that sort of thing, you know? I'm working hard for the track team, so I think that's good enough for now. I agree. As for the future, well, <laughs> I've got plenty of time to think about it later. Yuko is smiling happily. I feel like our relationship has grown. Yay. I guess this isn't the best place for a long conversation, huh? Oh, it's fine. It's a mall. We can relax a little bit. I'm gonna go drop these off at the storage room. See ya. Oh, bye. Oh. Ouch. Shit, you okay? Ow. Hey, it's dangerous to be running around here. Wait, aren't you? Oh, Andy Yuko. Pardon? Oh 
many times do I have to tell you? You can call me Big Sis, nothing else. Calling you Auntie makes you sound old. Oh, will you shut up? Oh no, they're gonna catch me. See ya, Auntie. Stop calling me that! And he's gone. Yep. That kid lives across the street from me. Why on earth are they playing tag in a place like this? You don't really see you don't really see kids playing tag in a well the place like this. Or just a mall in general. I mean it's dangerous, right? You should go play in the schoolyard or something. Yeah. Oh no. The school gate is gonna close soon. Uh I'll see you at practice. Uh, see you later, Yuko. And off she goes. After saying goodbye to Yuko, I decided to go back to the dorm. What's up, dude? Finally, the three-day weekend starts tomorrow. I asked some peaks if they wanted to hang out, but the only ones interested were guys. You had best use your time wisely. Need I remind you that midterms are quickly approaching? Uh, and here I was thinking I could just live in blissful ignorance for a few days. <sighs> Not at this rate, I'm gonna spend Golden Week the same way I always have! Lazing around, hanging out with di- not, not that I don't love your company, my dude, but... It's just sad. Too sad. Even though I'm a changed man this year. God damn it, I love that guy. Well, it's just about Golden Week. I was looking forward to improving on past year's Golden Week training regimen. But I guess that won't be happening this year. No, you still gotta recover, bud. Our school's exams tend to be difficult, but you'll be fine as long as you're diligent about studying. That said, you just transferred and then were hospitalized for a time. I'll see what I can do to help you. Yay! Hey! Let's try to have some fun during Golden Week. Especially since we'll be busy studying midterms right after it. Oh yeah. And as for me, that is where I'm going to end it. I do not know how long I've been recording, but I might be able to get two episodes out of this to cover for the weekend. I'm pretty sure people will know by the time this part even goes up that I succeeded. <gasps> see, now I'm legitimately curious. I might just look up that guy to see if there is a good way to manage all of my time to um, make sure I get all of the social links done. Because I, I actually do want to see if I can make this a an actual complete run. You know what I mean? Anyway, if you all like this, be sure to let me know. And thank you all oh so much for watching. And I will see all of you in the next video.